Hello everyone. My name is Sandeep Yadav. I work as a technical solutions architect at Cisco and in this quick video tutorial we are going to look at encrypted visibility engine on Cisco Firepower. We're going to take a look at one of the problem this particular engine is, is solving on Cisco Next, uh, Next Gen Firewalls. So let's get started. So so basically, we, as we know, we are surfing the internet using HTTP2. There are a lot of websites which are already moving to HTTP3. Now, the, the main thing to note here is HTTP3 is not something that runs on, uh, it's, it's not that something that runs on TCP as a transfer protocol because we know, uh, we know TCP443 uh, is typically uh, using TCP as a transport protocol. Now we, the main intent here is we want a better, uh, better performance, improved performance with lower latency compared, uh, right, compared to HTTP two or Web two point oh. But it's really not practical to have in, uh, to have introduced a new transport layer protocol which is even superior or better than TCP as a transport layer protocol because there are so many intermediary devices and we just cannot make the whole internet change uh, to a new transport protocol. So what has happened is there's uh, an evolution where we have, where Google has developed or introduced a new protocol called QUIC, uh, which stands for Quick UDP Interconnection. Now this is a new transport protocol that supports various application layer protocol. So if you see, we have uh, on the right hand side we have IP, then we have UDP 443, not TCP, it's UDP 443, and then we have a transfer protocol called QUIC, which is able to carry HTTP 3 protocol. Now HTTP 3 is the newer version, uh, is the new version of HTTP protocol that is designed to run over quick. And this offers improved performance and lower latency compared to its predecessor, HTTP2, which is on the left. Right. Now, the problem, uh, second problem statement here is that we cannot decrypt this. So now, since we cannot decrypt this, how do you get visibility and detections and control into a traffic which is quick based? So HTTP3 is not the only traffic. There is DTLS, we have quick datagram extensions, we have WebRTC, we have uh, gRPC, this is uh, basically a high performance open source RPC framework, uh, again developed by Google, uh, but uh, it uses, uh, it allows, again, uh, the main intent is lower latency communication between client server applications. So there are a lot of traffic which is going towards making use of quick as a protocol so let's take a look at this how firepower can help you take control get visibility detections and control for quick as a protocol so on on firepower when you go to access control policies and under advanced setting there is this tab or toggle called encrypted visibility engine as highlighted here this is basically just a toggle that you can uh, you can use one point to note you must have threat license or ips license on your firepower device to make use of this particular engine because this gets um, feeds or updated signatures from uh, as part of vdb updates and the vdb updates are part of of threat license so with that if you have this uh, this thing already set what you can then, what we can then do is we can go to access control rule. And what I have done is I have created a rule uh, called allow quick. And I am referring to HTTP3 or quick as an application in my rule. Next, I just want you to take a look at the sample uh, traffic. So we have this YouTube video. Uh, that is playing and if you right click and inspect you can see both of them are using QUIC as a protocol. So if you thought this is TCP443 because it's HTTPS, no that's not true. Uh, this is second example, Cloudflare. Again we are using HTTP3. This is only for testing 
uh, but we are using quick and HTTP3 uh, just for, uh, for the confirmation. And we have one more example here. This is uh, Google Play as an application. And again, this is using QUIC as a protocol. Finally, the host is 10.10.10.144, which we are using for this demonstration. So now it's time to look at the logs. We are on the Unified Events page. So as you can see, the web application identified here is YouTube. You can see the URL. We are hitting the same rule called allow-quick. The visibility that you get is not just web, but also client. So in this case, the client application is Chrome. Uh, UDP 443, HTTP3 as a application protocol, and the client application is Chrome. So you have end-to-end -end visibility, not decrypted. Everything, every aspect of this traffic is captured. Let's take a look at the second traffic, which we had, uh, which was Google Play. So the web application is Google Play. Client application is Chrome. It's HTTP3 as application protocol. Uh, UDP 443 again. And last, Let's take a look at the Cloudflare example that we had taken, which was only a website for testing uh, that your browser is, uh, is making use of quick. So URL is Cloudflare. The web application identified is Cloudflare. Uh, we, are, we were using HTTP3 as client. It's HTTP3 as application protocol and going over UDP 443. So as demonstrated in this particular case, we are using allow as an action but since you have the deeper visibility even without decrypting this traffic you could potentially take block as an action as well so that's uh, that's all here i hope you have enjoyed this video if you found this useful please hit a like button and share with uh, other friends make sure if you are on 7.2 you just go to the access policy turn that toggle button to make use of this feature Thank you for watching.